Well, what is going on, everybody? We're down here at the river. With Jason chilling over here. Looking for some spring Chinook. It's really, really hot. But we're gonna try. Trying a few different things. Dudes are throwing across each other and crossing lines, crying. Oh, we're not crossing lines. I've seen that line we're cross. I've seen that line oh. cross. Oh, and he just missed a fish. <laughs> oh, shit. What do you know? Well, we'll come back when we got some fish. We're definitely going to catch some fish today, so we'll be back. No, no touchy. No touchy. Look at the size of that fungus. I think you're sick, tree. Well, all right, guys, I tried to get the camera on, but you know, in the heat of the moment, it can be a little bit wild. But what happened was there was a fish sitting on the, like, the side, like, just right on the bank, right next to the trees. And I actually, I saw him and I was working a buzz bomb. I flipped the buzz bomb out, like just a couple feet in front of his face. And he just immediately reacted, lunged forward and just smashed that buzz bomb. I wish I would have got it on film because it was a really, really cool experience. And then he ran out here in the river and it was like he hit this heavy tail out. I think a fish just jumped right behind me. He hit this heavy tail out and it's like he went all the way down here in these heavy trees. Pan down there real quick. He went all the way down here in this heavy current down in the trees. And like, I'll be totally honest, I thought he was gone at that moment. But somehow I got him to turn around, got his nose turned and he started working his way up this seam. Come all the way up here by this log that I'm sitting on, and my buddy Brian behind the camera finally got him in a net. So he is a springer, so he's a little bit colored up because it's a larger fish, but it is a springer, and so I'm not too worried about it. There he is. This fish actually cut really, really well, and I'm really stoked about that. Definitely a good 28, 30 pound Chinook hatchery as you can see and he's got this crazy battle scar up here it's like he must have brushed a boat or i don't know I, I i wanted to say sea lion but it's like almost just like rubbed off a little bit so i think he might have brushed a rock or a boat or something but subscribe for big old fish like that we're gonna get back at it we got a couple more hours to try to catch a couple more fish Well, Brian, we're at a new spot, and you still are sucking it up, or what? Yep. Catch. Jason's got something. A big old snag. Big old rock bass. Come on. This is Brian's big catch of the day. He caught a filleted salmon carcass. <laughs> Among God knows how many rigs. He caught like six at the other spot too, so he's catching everything but the fish. <laughs> Doubled up. Fish over here, fish over there. Oh God, watch them cross. Here we got a second net coming out. They're bringing a net out. Doubled up. 
That one's bulldogging right there. He's got a minute, man. That fish, that fish is running down river. Dude, what? You hurt a fucking whale? <laughs> watch your head, watch your head. <laughs> Nice, I chrome. I seen the chrome. That one's in the net. Come on, man. Do it. Just demolish that bead, bro. Hold that bad boy up. Nice work, my man. Yeah, spring chinook, baby, spring chinook. Yeah, let me see that yeah, one. Let's get the double, Let huh? me see that one. Yeah, 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 yeah. You double. guys both got to stand right next to each other. Right, so Look at that bad double, boy. Yeah. There's hatch two. Yeah, they're both hatcheries, man. Look at that. Spring chinook. I should go grab mine. <laughs> yeah, here's the pig, bro. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, we, uh, our group didn't catch any more fish as you've seen we uh, we were with some other people they caught a couple of fish We're only going home with one today uh, You know today Jason failed and that doesn't happen very often yeah. where I take a fish home and Jason doesn't and so I'm kind of just soaking in this moment I hope you're soaking it in with me uh, Hit that thumbs up if you know you think I'm a better fisherman than Jason? I'm just kidding. Make sure, make sure to subscribe, guys. Until next time, we will see you.